So how do I turn a PJ set into an outfit in my mind? Accessorize. Hi guys, thanks for stopping by. In today's video, I have some clearance pieces from Walmart that I cannot wait to share with you. You are not going to believe these prices. My name is Teresa. I'm so glad that you're here. Now let's get started. I do want to say a huge thank you to today's sponsor, Thrive Market. We'll talk about them in a little bit. I want to get right to the clearance pieces. Let's look at the first one. I've had my eye on this particular sweater in store for quite a while now. I was trying to justify picking up another kind of fair aisle pattern sweater and then this one went on clearance and I knew it was time to pick it up. This one is by Time and True. They're calling this the Intarsia sweater. I have never heard that term before. To my eye, it just looks like a fair aisle pattern, but I'm sure there's a difference. This was $19.98, so it was already under $20, and now it is under $12, coming in at $11.98. I really cannot believe some of these prices. This comes in sizes extra small through 3XL. It is available in six colorways. I'm sure showing this in a size small and I do find that it fits true to size. The fabric is 97% polyester and 3% spandex. It also has super easy care instructions. It's just machine wash cold and tumble dry. This sweater features easy pullover styling, a crew neckline, ribbed neck, cuffs, and hem, and a relaxed fit. In a previous video, I showed a very similar sweater to this one by Free Assembly, and I absolutely love that sweater. That one is also on clearance, so I'll mention that one again in just a moment. But I wanted to pick this one up in particular because this is a lighter weight. I love the color combination of this. I think this is so pretty. It has this pop of blue with pink and yellow, and the pattern does go all the way around. I also love this olive green, and this is one of those sweaters that feels baby blanket soft. So I was so happy to get this at the clearance price. Speaking of that Free Assembly Fair All sweater, when I bought it, it was $35, and at that time, I said that it was worth every penny, and I still feel that way. It is so well made. It has some substance to it. It is rich in cotton. I've washed and worn mine several times, and it is holding up very well. That very sweater is now on clearance for $21. So if you live in a colder climate, you might want to pick it up while it's on clearance, and they do still have most sizes. This one does come in sizes extra small through 2XL. It comes in two colorways. I'm showing what they call the washed black in a size small. I did find it to fit true to size. This almost leans toward a navy to my eye, but it is a soft black. I love this one so much and highly recommend it if you can get it in your size. After seeing the quality of the last free assembly sweater, I decided that I wanted to try another one because I just think the quality is so good, and the one that I have on now is also on clearance. On the Walmart website, they're calling this the Midweight Crew Neck Sweater. It was originally $24. It's now on clearance for $18. It is available in two colorways. I'm wearing this in a size small. I will circle back to that. The fabric is 95% cotton and 5% wool. I have to tell you that I have an aversion to wool and I honestly don't feel the wool in this. Of course, it is only 5% of the total fabric. The care is super easy, machine wash cold inside out and tumble dry. This features pullover styling, a relaxed fit, a knit body, and then the ribbed cuff and hemline. Now I will say that although this sweater does fit true to size, in hindsight I wish I had sized up on this because this has a very high cotton content and I suspect that this is going to shrink. So right now it fits me perfectly fine, but I probably should have bought a medium. With that said, I love this kind of goldenrod yellow color. I am not historically a plaid person per se, but there's just something about the look of this one that just drew my eye. It has a little bit of a preppy look, which really isn't typically my aesthetic. And in fact, let me know in the comments down below if you like plaids in general. I really like this particular plaid, but in general, I'm not a plaid person. I had this pair of free assembly jeans in my Walmart cart for quite a while, and I just could not justify buying another pair of jeans. That is to say, until these went on clearance. 
These are called the high-rise bootcut jeans, which I'm really into at the moment. These were $32, and now they're on clearance for just $19. They also come in an impressive size range. They have sizes 0 through 22, and they also have regular and short inseams. As a point of reference, I am wearing a 10 short. I went up in size on these because of the high cotton content, which I will circle back to. These are available in five washes. I'm sharing the dark wash, which is also something that I'm really into lately. The fabric is 90% cotton, and then the other 10% is a blend of elastane. These also have super easy care instructions. They're just machine wash cold inside out and then tumble dry. These figure flattering jeans are a slim fit, which is another reason why I sized up because they are fitted in the thighs. They're a classic five pocket style in a stretch denim fabric for added comfort. Now, if you watch my videos regularly, first and foremost, thank you. I appreciate every one of you. You know that I love time and true jeans. They are a good value. I think they are a good quality. I wear them all of the time. I have time and true jeans in skinny jeans, which I still wear with boots. I have straight leg and I have boot cut. I was very hesitant to even try a pair of the free assembly jeans because I thought I just don't need them, but the price was too good and I wanted to try them. Let me tell you, when I put these on, in my mind, I think they jumped right up to the top spot of favorite jeans ever. I love the wash of these. These were comfortable. For me personally, I'm kind of over the ripped, distressed look, so I'm really enjoying a dark wash, clean denim, and this one fits the bill. Love, love, love these. My Thrive Market order just arrived, and this box is going to save me a trip to the grocery store. Thrive Market is an online membership-based grocery store that makes healthy living easy and affordable for everyone. I save on average of 30% on the items that I get from Thrive Market compared to brick and mortar stores. And if by some miracle you find the same product for less, Thrive Market will match that price. So I can shop with confidence and always know that I'm getting the best price possible. In this order, I got some of the Thrive Market Fajita Seasoning Mix. I especially like this because there is no sugar added, and with a low-carb eating style, I can make fajita bowls, so I got a bunch of these. I also picked up a plant-based chili. It's ready to serve. You just pour it out of this pouch and can microwave it. I've honestly never tried a plant-based meat substitute, so I was really curious about this one, and plus it seems super easy. In my last Thrive Market order, I tried some of this right rice. It's made with vegetables, and it really hits the spot if you're eating low carb but you're craving rice. There are several flavors. I got this one in the Spanish rice. I also picked up some sea salt flakes. I love to use this as a finish to a dish. You just sprinkle a little bit on top and it gives it that salty, crispy texture. It's also really good if you're doing something sweet and savory, whether you're making a chocolate cookie and you want that little hit of salt. I'm really excited to have this actually. One of my favorite snacks when I'm following a low carb diet is mixed nuts. So I picked this one up. This is the Thrive Market non-GMO paleo snack mix. Now don't judge me. I typically follow a low carb diet but every once in a while, a girl needs some macaroni and cheese. That is my weakness, so I have it as a rare treat. And whenever I have it, I like this one in particular. This is the Annie's. It's the rich and creamy shells and white cheddar. I also want to point out that anytime you order anything in a bottle or a jar, it is always carefully wrapped. I have never received a broken product or a leaking product from Thrive Market. So this is in this honeycomb recyclable paper. This is actually the free gift that I chose when I was checking out. This is the Thrive Market Organic Soy Sauce. I use a lot of soy sauce and I can always use another bottle of this. I was especially happy to get it for free. I also ordered a snack bundle and I was really excited to see this particular bundle because it had three of my favorites in it. So this first one is cauliflower stalks cheddar flavor. I also got the cauliflower stalks with sea salt. Now even though this next one has sugar in it, it is very minimal so I'm really excited to try these. In fact it says you need this, that's funny. This is the cinnamon plant-based churro puffs. I can't wait to try these. Actually, who am I kidding? I'm going to try these right now. They just sound too good. I have to stop filming these videos when I'm hungry. Mmm. 
crispy with that hint of cinnamon and they're not overly sweet. Okay, maybe one more. Regardless of what eating plan you follow, whether it's keto, gluten-free, vegetarian, vegan, organic, Thrive Market has all of those specialty products that you might have to go from store to store to find in the first place, and you're going to get them for less. As you can see on this order, I saved a significant amount of money on the items that I picked out. I also earned some Thrive Market cash and I got a free gift. And who doesn't love a free gift? Actually, you know what I'm thinking? It is almost lunchtime. I want to go ahead and cook this up. It looks so good in the photo, but I want to see if it looks the same in real life. On the back, it says to tear the pouch one inch to vent and microwave for 90 seconds. That sounds easy. Okay, I am pretty impressed. This looks identical in person in real life as it does in the photo. And that is not always the case with things like this. I went ahead and added some shredded cheese, some sour cream, and some scallion because that's how I typically eat chili. Let's see how it tastes. Mmm! This has a surprisingly good flavor. It's not too hot, but it does have some complex spice to it. I bet if I opened one of these pouches and put it in the crock pot right before my husband came home and served it, he would think that I made it from scratch and that it had meat in it. What do you guys think? Should I put this in the crock pot and not tell my husband it's not meat? Let me know in the comments down below. Mmm, I can't get over how good this is. I also can't stop eating it. Whenever I'm placing an order on the Thrive Market website, of course I always get my staple tried and true items that I already know and love, but I also love to try new products, and Thrive Market has so many to choose from. To get started saving on groceries today, just click on the link in the description box below, or if you prefer, go to thrivemarket.com backslash Teresa Renee. You will receive 30% off of your first order, and you will receive a free gift valued at up to $60, which is the equivalent of a yearly membership, so it kind of pays for the membership in and of itself. I do want to say a huge thank you to Thrive Market for sponsoring this video. Now let's get back to the fashion. Every time I go to my local Walmart store, I swing by where these vests are, just hoping that they're on clearance, and they finally are. This is by Time and True. They're calling this the reversible quilted vest. It was $29.98, so a little bit up there, just at $30, and they are now on clearance for $15. They come in nine colors, and I have to say that there is still a pretty good assortment at my local Walmart of this vest. They come in sizes extra small through 3XL. I showed this vest in a previous video in a winter white, and at $15, I went back and picked up a second one, this time in this olive green color. Now, as I mentioned, this vest is reversible. I have to be honest, I would probably never wear it on the furry side, let's just say, because one time I had on a furry vest, and my husband called it my Barney Rubble vest. And ever since then, I just have it in my mind that I don't want to look like Barney Rubble. So I tend to wear this on the quilted side, which puts the nice fluffy side closer to the body. I think it looks cute either way. I just have that image in my head now. This does have the toggles at the waist so that you can cinch it in and get a little bit of shape from it. The main reason that I wanted to pick up a second one of these is I have an aversion to wearing coats, and it has to be pretty cold before I I will put a coat on. I love to have a vest to layer with because over long sleeves it kind of takes place of a coat and then if it's super cold I can still layer this underneath of a coat. I love this green color. I also still love the original one that I bought in the off-white. At $15, if you can find the colors that you love in your size, it is well worth the price. Now, I don't always feel that I have to be matchy-matchy when I'm wearing a vest as a layering piece, but I wanted at least one long sleeve top that specifically matched this green vest. I did pick up this plaid button down that I'm wearing with the vest in store, and now that I think about it, I have two plaid pieces, so maybe I am a plaid person, who knows, but I digress. This is by the brand Time and True. It is still full price at my local Walmart at $14.98. It comes in sizes extra small through 3XL, and it comes in a bunch of colorways. 
It is 100% cotton, so it is very breathable, but that also means that it is probably going to be prone to shrinking. So I did size up to a size medium. This does have super easy care. It's just machine wash cold and tumble dry. I'm very partial to the color navy blue, and then this has the exact same olive green running through the plaid. This is perfect for layering. I had this next piece in my Walmart cart probably for two months. There was something about the pattern that just kept drawing my eye, but I wasn't willing to pay full price, and now it's on clearance. This is by the brand Scoop. It is the tie waist midi dress with ruffle sleeves. It was $45, which I have to be honest was a little bit too rich for my blood. It is now on clearance for $22, so half off basically. It comes in sizes extra small through 2XL. It is available in four colorways, and honestly, I loved every one of the colors. I had a hard time deciding, but this magenta really drew me in. The fabric is 100% polyester. It is super easy care instructions, just machine wash cold inside out and tumble dry. This fun and flirty dress has a keyhole button closure at the back of the neck, but I will say that I was able to put this on without using the button, so I was very relieved about that. It has a self-tied belt to help define the waist, and then it has short raglan sleeves. It has a tiered chiffon-like skirt, and it's also fully lined with the exception of the sleeves, which makes sense because you want those to be a little bit more floaty. I have to be honest, when I watched the footage back, I did not love this dress on me. I think that it will look lovely on most ladies. I happen to carry any extra weight, and I have a little bit of extra fluffage going on right now, right in the belly area. And there is something about the cut of this dress that I thought drew attention to it. It could be the self-tied belt. It could be the way I tied the self-tied belt. I also want to mention that this is a lined dress, and I do not really have hips per se, but this was really fitted at the hip. So if you have wider hips, I would definitely go up a size because you can always cinch the waist in with the self-tied belt, but I think it would be rather slim fitting. I love the color. I like the concept but I don't know about this one. So be sure and let me know what you think of it in the comments down below. Let's look at the next piece. Another piece that's on clearance at my local Walmart is the Time and True button-down cardigan. They were originally $14.98 and they are on clearance for $8.98. I cannot get over that price. These versatile cardigans, which are perfect for layering, come in sizes extra small through 3XL and are available in four colors. Now, as you can see by the number of these that I have in my hand, this top is one of my favorite purchases from Walmart and it is on clearance right now. These are by Time and True. They're calling these the Flutter Sleeve Top. They were originally $13.98, which wasn't a bad price to start with, and they are now on clearance for $8. I cannot get over it. They come in sizes extra small through 3XL, and they are available in four colors. I have three of them. Now, even though these are a short sleeve top, I decided to include them in this video right in the middle of winter. One, because they're on clearance and they still have a lot of colors and sizes, but also because of the weight of these. These are not a thin t-shirt material. These almost feel like a lightweight sweatshirt. I loved this when it first came out. I paid full price for all three of these, so I have it in three colors. I have the apple cider, which is very similar to the yellow of the sweater that I'm wearing. I also have it in this beautiful magenta or fuchsia, and then I also have it in black. I think this also comes in an olive green, but the reason I'm showing a short sleeve top is I still, to this day, wear these all of the time, and I layer with them. These are my first layer, and then I will wear a jacket or a cardigan over them. So I just wanted to point that out because they're such a good price. The next item is also a short sleeve top, but it's one of my favorites, and I also layer with these. These were originally $11.98, and they are on clearance for $7. 
They come in sizes extra small through 3XL and they are available in four colors. Now that these are on clearance for such a low price, I'm thinking about picking up the additional two colors because every time that I wear one of these, I get a compliment. Even though I'm layering with them now that it's cold and just this little crochet part is peeking out underneath of a cardigan or a jacket, someone comments on these every single time. I love these so much. At the beginning of the season, I showed this super soft color block sweater by Time and True. These are now on clearance as well, and they come in a bunch of colors. These were $14.98, and currently at my local Walmart, they are $9. They come in sizes extra small through 3XL, and they are available in eight colorways. Just as the point of reference, the cream one that I'm showing is in a size small, and it does fit true to size. I have washed mine a couple of times now. I turn it inside out. I know this sounds a little bit extra, and I put it in a garment bag, and then I tumble dry. This has that baby blanket soft feel to it, and I suspected that it was going to pill, so I'm taking the extra precautions with the care, and so far, so good. I just wanted to point this out to you because it is such a good clearance price, and there are still quite a few patterns and size ranges in store. Super random side note, and this PJ set is not on clearance, but I'm bringing it up for a reason. I showed these Joy Spun two-piece jogger PJ sets in a previous holiday video. I will link that video in the cards above. After I finished filming that video, I still had this PJ set on, and it was so cozy and so comfortable, and I'm looking in the mirror and I thought, could that pass as an actual outfit? And lo and behold, Many of you in the comments said, do you think you could wear that as a regular outfit? So I decided to take this one in the navy blue and style it. Another reason that I bring this up is because moving into the rest of the winter, although some of these patterns were clearly holiday, many of them were not. So how do I turn a PJ set into an outfit in my mind? accessorize. So I pulled a pair of plain gold hoop earrings and I threw on a couple of different types of sneakers that I owned just to see how it would look. Now there's something about the racing stripe on this that makes it feel very athleisure to me in the first place. I kind of think it works, but I would love to know what you think, so be sure and let me know in the comments down below. Do you think that this PJ set passes as an actual outfit. I also want to comment on the weight of the fabric on this one because this is not a flimsy thin PJ material by any stretch. I have lightweight sweatshirts and sweatpants that feel identical to this, so I really feel like I could get away with wearing this, maybe to Walmart. Let me know what you think in the comments down below. I share outfit inspiration, styling tips, and my <laughs> and there goes another car. <laughs> Take two. <laughs> and I'm not even in the frame. I'm just talking to the wall over there. <laughs> oh, here I am. <laughs> I'm very partial to the color navy green. Navy green? That's not a color. <laughs> Thrive Market isn't... Why am I yelling? <laughs> it's echoing in the kitchen. <laughs> I need to tone it down a little bit. <laughs> an online. <laughs> I'm supposed to be filming another video right now, but it can wait because I am not walking away from this bowl of chili now. If you want to see even more affordable fashion for us ladies over 50, you're going to want to check out this video next. I share outfit inspiration, styling tips, and my personal take on all of the current trends that make them a little bit more wearable. Thanks so much for spending a part of your day with me, and I will see you next time.